Hello, fluffy people of the world. My name is Liquid Blitz, and welcome back to Bioshock. Is my camera on the wrong side? Uh, hang on. Is it on the wrong side? Yes, it is. Motherfucker, I forgot. I forgot which game I was playing. Hang on. Hang on. Gone and balls this up already, haven't I? Right off the bat. Hang on. Uh, bear with me. Uh, flip horizontal. Is this gonna work? Woohoo! It worked. And there you go. Live editing. Well, not live, but you know what I mean. Whilst I'm still playing. Okay. Because I can't cover up the health bar on that. It's important. Okay. Um, oh, another thing. Ah, oh, you see, I'm not, I'm not prepared at all. <laughs> uh, let's get rid of the FPS counter. Okay, welcome back to Bioshock 2. So... Let's recap and see where we're at. Uh, rescue or harvest three little sisters. Stanley Poole, an ex-reporter with connections to Sophia Lamb, wants to prevent Lamb from getting her hands on the atom contained in the corpses of Dionysus Park. It seems that the atom itself contains memories of events that Stanley would rather Lamb not know, because he's a creepy reporter, um, he, a journalist. He wants you to deal with the Little Sisters to make sure his secret stays buried. How you do this is up to you. Find all three sisters, deal with their big daddies, and rescue or harvest. Do this and Stanley will unlock the track to Fontaine Futuristics, bringing you one step closer to Eleanor. Okay, now. Um, yeah, I, I reloaded the game and there was a big daddy in my face, so we're, we're starting high octane today. Um, now, I didn't recognize this Big Daddy. I can't tell if this is the one that shoots, like, mines and shit at you that you can throw back. I don't think it is. This might be the first of the new Big Daddies. So I don't know what this one's gonna do. This one might kick my ass. Um, I'll tell you what. We'll start with the spear gun. Um, if he starts throwing shit at me... I might just turn my audio down, Jesus. If he starts tossing shit at me, I might have to, um... Telekinesis. But we'll see. Uh, let's use rocket spears. And let's just start firing. I'm scared. It's been a month since I've played. Because, uh, I've been sick lately. Um... So, I'm out of practice. Rocket! Yeah! Oh shit, oh shit, it's after my ass. Use the lion. Use the lion for protection. You mistake my nature, Delta. Oh shit! <gasps> I wish no Adam for myself. Eleanor is the dream, and she needs neither weapons nor parlor tricks. Uh, I'm scared. Uh, oh, I've had him. You know what? Let's just drill and see how much damage I do. You know what? That's that's pretty good damage if I keep freezing him. Look at that! Ow! Charge him one more time. I'm trying to heal! I'm trying to heal! I'm trying to heal! Oh my god, I just wrecked that big daddy. Right, before she runs off... Um, adopt. You're safe with me now. I missed completely what Lamb just said. Smart, see? You put it to work, and all that Adam ends up in you. But you're sort of a silent partner. So that's tops with me. I'm so gonna kill you, you creepy motherfucker. Um, I will listen back to what she just said, because I completely missed that, because a, a, a bouncer was charging me. Um, for some reason, I didn't recognize the drill arm, uh, so I didn't realize this was just your basic bouncer. Um, it's an elite bouncer, and I just... I only had to heal basically one time. Or two times. Yeah, my drill, my freezing drill perk is working brilliantly. Oh, shit. Let's get it. Um, what, what is it to quick save? F5, there we go. Alright, before we do that, um, I did notice I've got a couple of empty slots in my tonics, and I have a tonic not equipped that is just going to make melee combat even better. I should have probably done it before I fought that thing. Um, oh, I don't have any slots. But that's fine. There's one that's so important, I need to put it on. Uh... Health stations... Oh, fuck that. It's Firestorm. You emit a burst of fire when struck by melee attacks, damaging all around you. I thought I had one of those for electricity, um, but I guess that was the first game. 
Because I've looked through all my things and I don't have any um, electrical versions of this on. Um, so I'm going to put that on. So it's funny, me drilling them will might has a chance to freeze them, but if they hit me, they also have a chance of getting burned. So there you go, done. And right, let's listen to what she said. Uh, what, a, what a time for her to talk to me, as I'm going toe-to-toe -to -toe with a bouncer. You mistake my nature, Delta. I wish no Adam for myself. Eleanor is the dream, and she needs neither weapons nor parlor tricks. If you say so. Huh. If you say so. Right, let's uh, harvest body number one. Which is right here. And I'll quick save it again. I can't believe how well that freezing while you're drilling thing worked. I froze him like four or five times in a row. Which is a bit overpowered. It, it could barely do anything to me. We did find it. Harvest. Um, let's get your electro bolt ready. So, stun and drill charge is what we're going to be doing. Shit! Oh, two in one. Um. Oh, ho, ho, ho. Right, my drill fuel is getting low here. I might have to pull out your, your spear gun. <laughs> oh, this is so fun. Oh shit, oh shit, this is bad. This is bad, this is bad. You know what, actually, these guys are doing quite a lot of damage to me. Oh, I'm, I'm empty. That explains that. So I can't drill or charge. I tell you what, let's yeah. Have I done? What the fuck? He's nicer than other daddies. That was fast. Yeah, I I, I forgot to I, I didn't see how much drill fuel I spent on the big daddy. My bad. But let's just buy some. I've got nearly the max dollars, so let's just buy a load more. I was watching the last episode back again, just to... It's what I do to refresh myself if I've gone too long without playing. And uh, I said something which I kind of forgot recently, and it's... I want to basically be melee and as, as long range, um, the spear gun. Because it's the most steampunk. I want to try and avoid bullets and so on. Um, but I could, I could have used the spear in that fight right there. Especially when I'm out of drill fuel, I should probably switch to this as your backup. Um, oh. That's hack. One, two, three, four, done. Woohoo! Honestly. Max. Uh, yeah, just max. I've got so much money. That's a bonus of not buying, like, not having to buy any ammo or food or anything. Um, I've got so, I've got the max money all the time. Right, electro bolt drill. Um, right, I might as well. I've got to get three little sisters, and that's two bodies each. So I've got to do. S I've just realised what I've got to do. I've got to do six of those gathering events, which is kind of a pain in the ass. Um, now I I was down here. There's a little sister. Uh, where are they? Oh, the little sister icons have disappeared, now I've got one. Well, this little sister was down there, so let's complete this area ahead of me. And then we never have to come back again. I've missed this game, it's been like a month. It, I didn't have COVID, but I had something over the Christmas period when I'm playing this game. So it's, it, I haven't been able to record lately because I've had a horrible cough and I've been sick and all this other shit. So I've missed this game. I literally have been missing every day, just charging like a lunatic <laughs> into combat. Uh, right, let's try regular... Oh shit. 
Let's try a regular spear gun damage. Headshot, see what it does. Oh my god, this is a good gun. Oh shit, I think... I'm never ever gonna utilize this camera right. What is wrong with me? I know people keep reminding me in the comments you can even do it to, you know. Shit! Oh, I've gonna fuck that up. I missed the blue one. People keep reminding me you can do it to cameras and turrets and stuff. I can't even remember to do it to main enemies. I'm such a shit. Uh, I'm good, right. Oh, somebody told me f uh, what they're saying is actually in Spanish, which would explain why I can't understand it. You know, my, my biggest problem with the spear gun, it, on the keyboard at least, it's on number seven. So one, one on the keyboard is drill, seven is spear gun, and that's a that's a hell of a reach for my finger. One and seven. I wish I could rebind that to two, so I can just use one and two for the rest of the game, but... Um, let's just do it. Let's not think about it. Uh... Okay, here we go. Here we go. S same, same deal. Stun and charge. Um, I don't like it when she's got a line of sight of ones in the distance. Shitty stuff. Oh, canal is loads. These ones are hurting the shit out of it. <laughs> Jesus. Headshot. <laughs> yes. I need to watch out of my health. I nearly died a couple of times then. Just by being too, um... Well, too much of a dick. Being too carefree and just charging in. But you've got to admit, it's working. As long as I remember to heal in time. It is working. It's like a reckless approach. But I'm tough enough to do it. Just... Push it. I mean... What a fucking combo. Charge, and then they are out of action for the rest of the fight. Charge, dead. I've definitely stumbled onto, like, possibly the best way to play this game. Anyway, right, let's rescue one out of three. Um, cool. Sleepy time is near. Go to sleep. Okay. Oh, what's going on? Father, this atom you found contains memories from all the bodies here. Normally, only a little sister can see them. Ooh. But I can show you what Stanley is trying to hide. Oh. When Mother was taken away, Stanley was left in charge of Dionysus Park. He spent all her money oh my God. these mad parties. <laughs> it was like he was trying to ruin her. Oh my god, face in the breasts. So this guy is just a piece of shit. You okay there? <laughs> Keep your eye on the brass ring, brother. Find the rest of the sisters. Keep your face out of the breasts, sir. Motherfucker. So this guy went ape shit. <laughs> just spent all her cash on like prostitutes and parties and shit. That's actually hilarious. I want to I want to tell Lamb now. She probably already knows. Subject Delta's just a serial number, amigo. I did a lot of digging on you for a feature once. They used to call you Johnny Topside. Found the city all on your own in a diving bell. Real shame what they did to you. Oh. Is that... 
I believe him, so I came from the surface, just uh, swimming. Cool. Drills, okay. Drill specialist sounds like the tonic for me. What's this? Uh, significantly decreases cost of plasmids. I'm using so much plasmids uh, in the form of electro bolt to stun them. Significantly decreases the cost, but limits weapon selection to the drill, hack tool, and camera. Oh, that is so, that is so nearly what I want. If that had spear gun in there, perfect tonic for me. But that's a problem, and I didn't use the camera again. <laughs> I'm shit. Oh, that's a problem, because I want the spear gun for long range specifically. And this is a big deal, because if I equip this, I cannot use any gun. It's not like it limits it to just in combat, it's permanently. I can only use the drill for fighting. I am, I am using the drill 95% of the time. The spear gun is just for long range headshot lols, really, and for when I run out of drill fuel. But when I'm out of fuel, that's it, I can only swing with the drill, which is way less damage. I'll, I'll try it. I was going to get rid of Booze Hound. There, right. No more spear gun. It makes... Uh, honestly, I'm a fan of whatever makes combat more... Um, simple. <laughs> I think that's really why I like the, the drill spear gun combo. It's just two weapons and I don't have to press a million buttons. Now it's even simpler. It's, it's drill, it's camera, or it's hack tool. I like the fact it throws... That is a guy outside my house revving his engine like a tool. I like the fact it does let you use the hack tool as well. Um, let's try it. I'm gonna. I'm so gonna miss the spear gun though. So, Ryan's goons are sweating me to prove this place is a closet commune, but I need time. Lamb's kid keeps staring me down like she knows that I'm a phony. I keep thinking of Johnny Topside, though. Hey, me. It took real guts to find Rapture like he did. It makes it easier not to crack if I sort of imagine that I'm him. It's a good thing I can't tell Lamb that, though. She'd probably say I got a secret need to fall into his arms and make a wild whoopee or something. Make wild whoopee with me. Has he got a crush on me? So he's just... I mean, it's not like Lamb is a million miles away. She's just in, in jail or whatever. Probably very temporarily. And he's just spending her cash like a maniac. Um, right, that the whole point of that tonic... It limits me to the drill, but it, re it lowers the amount of blue I use on... On plasmids. Honestly? I'm tempted to... Um, Hang on, is there a gene bank somewhere very close? I'm tempted to test uh, with that tonic on and off. To side by side, if you see what I mean? Right. Uh, okay, I've got the tonic on now. Let's see how much it uses. I know this is a waste, but just bear with me. It's worth the testing. That was a good... This is a big waste, hang on. Um, it's between the T and the R of Electro. Right, it's a good chunk. Let's switch it out now. Or just get rid of it. Um, there, right, okay, let's have another look. Uh, oh, it's like half. <gasps> oh, it's like half. That's actually, that's better than I could have imagined. I figure it would have been like 10% um, reduction or something, but that's straight up like a 50% reduction. Um, drill specialist. Okay, there we go. There we go. Back. That's really good. So that's basically twice as much stunning. I need to be th right. My the only resource I need to give a shit about now is drill fuel. That's it. Because once I'm out of that, I lose my main way of fighting at long range. Which is the charging. 
But even then, I can just keep stunning now because I've got more Eve and just, just swing away. Oh fuck. Oh, swing, 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 swing. I might also want to make more of a point of, on basic bitch enemies like that, just swinging. Because my drill charge uses a bunch of fuel. Right. Um, let's go find sister number two. That was a dead end, wasn't it? Oh, whoop, whoop! There, is there a door here? <laughs> yes, there is. Oh, somebody gave me a nice tip, by the way, which is uh, brand new for me. Um, at least in the first game. You can melt this shit without incinerate if you telekinesis a flaming object like a... Uh, I don't know, something that's on fire. A candle or some shit. Candle or something on fire. Um... Which is easier said than done. Now I actually think about it. What the hell is on fire? Maybe a lamp or a light would work. And I kind of want to test it. I'll tell you though, when it comes to big daddies, I, I might be a bit regretful of the drill specialist tonic. Um... You know, I keep forgetting that when they're stunned, even the regular swing does more damage. I'll try and drill charge less. Right, anything on fire? It doesn't help that this place is like, all watery and damp. I'm not gonna be able to find anything on fire. Oh, hello. Truth is in the body. Awareness of self is no miracle, Eleanor. It is a trick of the gene, an endless inner refrain asking, what's in it for me? To serve the world, we must grow deaf to the self. Are you ready? She is talking absolute now, shit. Stop listening to my voice. Stop listening. Stop. Difficult, isn't it? Human verbal cues are defensive coloration, camouflage. Play this recording until you no longer hear the words. Then you may observe the people for who they are. Oh, oh fuck's sake. So she's trying to teach Eleanor about the self, which I still maintain means nothing and is just noise. She's talking absolute nonsense. Play this tape until you can no longer hear my voice. I just said I was going to drill charge less, and then I go and drill charge every enemy. I don't know what the hell she's talking about. I really don't. I took a picture. Yes, I remember to take a picture for once. I took a picture on the one enemy type that I've already completed. Sometimes I think my brain is out to fuck me and just and just Um oh right, that's okay, that's that's the way through to everywhere else. Uh and that's the way back to the train station, isn't it? I'll tell you what, let's let's stop being a dick. There's no fire to be found, so let's just melt this shit. She's basically teaching Eleanor to just ignore her as well as everyone else. It's kind of weird. I love the fact that the tiniest puff of fire just melts a colossal chunk of ice. What the hell is that? There's like four cameras in here. Well, let's get to, uh... Let's get to hacking. Fuck! Fuck! Well, aren't I a dick? One, two, three, done. Ugh. 
What? Oh, got it. Bloody hell. Right, I'm gonna remote hack. I'm gonna auto hack that one. Jesus. I forgot I've got those mini turrets as well. I might want to lob those down for the next big daddy. Oh, the other camera behind, behind me is going to see me. Oh, I'm a dick. You know what? I've got one auto hacked on. Let's just use it. And then I'll do this last one uh, m manually. Um, achievement unlocked, Master Hacker. I used my last hack dart then, and then I magically got one more. Let's not be a dick, come on. Oh. Yeah. <laughs> I forgot that was auto. Okay. Bot shut down right here, just in case I trip a, a camera. That's a, come on. This game makes it a little too easy. Is there one more... Turret. Ah! Oh, hang on, hang on, hang on. Gotcha. One, two. Uh, I wonder what these guys do when they when you get a blue. They make them stronger or something. Oh fuck! Ah. Whoa, that was just that was good. I wonder how much stuff there is hidden in the ice in this room. Dude, I love the distant, like, sk underwater skyscrapers. I'm telling you now, if there's no, like, outside segment in this game where you're actually... We we've briefly been outside once already, but it wasn't a proper, like, swimming around the buildings type. If that doesn't happen, I'll be so upset. They will have missed, like, a huge trick there. Falling into place. New face. I have a new goddamn face. Who thought? Rapture. It's Fontaine. Paradise of the confidence man. I gotta keep revising the Atlas voice. I figure the accent gives me an excuse to lock myself in a room with a bottle and count the cash. War's on in full now, boy. And I've got a hell of a surprise for Andrew Ryan. Long time coming. And right about Ooh. now, I expect the prodigal son is booking his flight. Oh. Ah, he recorded that right before the start of the first game. Interesting. So yeah, makes sense that he's got to practice his accent, of course. Gives him an excuse to lock himself in his room with some booze. Fuck me, that sound scared the shit out of me. I'm not sure locking yourself in a room with booze is a great way to learn a new accent. It's hilarious, I don't need most of this ammo I'm getting now. Since it's just the drill. Oh! I didn't shr- <gasps> Dude, the references! I didn't see that I melted a cat. Oh, somebody froze a cat into place. Is this like some sort of Easter egg? Do the developers of this game like hate cats or something? The amount of dead cats I've found is weird. Like it's beyond, it's not, it's not funny, <laughs> kind of. But it, it, it's gone past humor and it's just, a, it's ridiculous now. There's dead cats in every imaginable way. Now we've got a frozen one. And it's even called Schrodinger. That's hilarious. That's probably the best cat reference I've seen yet. Especially considering it was lo it was like locked. Um, I I'm, I'm going to assume you know what Schrodinger's cat is. You can Google it if you don't. Um, but th but it's that's that's fitting that it was sort of locked inside ice where you can't see it. You don't know if it's alive or dead. So it's a combination of both until you reveal it. Um. Oh shit. Well, it's definitely dead. I was going to see if you could melt the the like the cat. It's definitely. Oh. <laughs> oh, I flopped over. Right. Oh. 
Jesus. You don't need noise to, to have a jump scare. Jesus Christ. Oh! oh, oh. See, I don't give a shit about a human frozen to death, but I, you, th you put a cat in a block of ice. Fuck you. You know, I'm playing Dying Light 2 at the moment with a group of friends. And I just tried to hit my Survivor Sense button to, to scan the area to see lootables. Right, what's this? Hardy machines. Stronger turrets and stuff? Hacking a turret or bot raises its max health. Ah, I don't care. It might be worth doing at some point. Um. What?! Bullshit! That was in the green. Oh, I've only got the drill! I've only got the drill! That's a problem. Um, fuck's sake. Ah, I can't go invisible. Um, right, hang on. Electro ball, I've got this. Why is the guys coming? I know I've set off the turrets, but what's with the, the, the teleporty boys suddenly appearing? Fuck you! Oh my god, this was a mistake. What a fucking colossal error in judgement. Aren't my cameras helping? You know what I mean? Yeah, good. Right, I should have brought them out here. I forgot I had uh, friendly turrets out here. Charge! Oh, fuck. What? Oh no, that's that's a friendly alarm this time. Ridiculous. <laughs> what is wrong with me? Oh come on. She just dodged me. Right. This was so fast, let's try it again. And if I set it off again, I'll go use the bot shutdown panel. Fuck's sake, what a complete fail. Okay, this is so fast. Oh, now it's slowed down because I'm shit, have you noticed? <gasps> that was in the green? Bullshit! Let's try again. Uh, uh, pff, we're gonna get this if it kills me. I swear to God above, I'm gonna I'm gonna slow mo that in the edit so you guys can see uh, uh, twice or something. I landed in the green. Oh, this is a bunch of sh. Oh no, that was good. Six auto hack darts. No, that was worth it. Right, anything else in this hellish fucking room? I can just hear death in the other room. <laughs> Right, anything else hidden? No, no, no. No, good, right, we're done in here, I think. At least I've got a constant alarm on the go. Right, we are officially done in here. Let's get back to the main room. Um, Where was the actual train park? I think it was back here. Um, Cohen's collection, where are we going next? Uh, we need a little sister, so we can either go down there, get her. I think we're going to go down there next, because it's a nice contained area. So I'll go out and hook a right, hook a right. Let's go. And buy more first aid kits while I'm at it. You know, it's a good thing that I'm, it now costs less to use all my plasmids, because I'm just, I'm wasting them. I'm even missing the enemies now. Right, let's go. Oh. First two. Nope. Oh. Right, okay. We're good. And also, while we're at it, let's buy more uh, drill fuel. Ah! 
Hang on. Oh, they die in one of the regular enemies without even the stun. That's great. Muy caliente. Fuck it. If I've got the cash, spend it. I haven't checked how much. F Arr! The fuck was that? Um. Right, this is a dead end. Okay, did I miss this before? I most uh, certainly did. Any tapes? Is water hurting me? No, it's just a sound effect. It, it's similar to the sound effect when you take a take a hit. I need to remember alcohol no long no longer gives me health and Eve. It'll, I think it'll drain the Eve now. Yeah, yeah. No tapes. Okay. This room. I've been told that I've missed uh, some tapes. And, and you, I do try to check every nook and cranny and I still miss them. It's, it's one of those situations I feel like no matter how hard I try, I'm still missing stuff. Uh, right. Hook her right down the end here. I do really try to be thorough in these games, I always say that, and it's true. I suppose I could be more thorough, but there's a certain point where you're no longer being thorough, you're just being slow and boring. Oh shit. Right, I need to remember you can also charge this thing to do an AoE stun. Oh shit. Ow! Hang on, auto hack time. No! Right, it's mine now. Um, you know what? Do I have a flashlight? Literally have forgotten if this game has a flashlight. I think it does. Da -da 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 -da. Um. I'm gonna get copyrighted from my own singing here. Do I not have a flashlight key? Could have sworn you have one, unless it's automatic. Hmm. Continue. Those rocket launcher turrets are ridiculous. Um, drill fuel is the only thing I care about. Nope. Oh, there you. Yes. Right, let's hack. Hello? Oh! Oh! He's been tied down and drowned or some shit. Oh! That's grim. That's really grim. That every episode of this game that goes by, I remember more and more how grim this, <laughs> this game actually is. Oh, am I full of... Yeah, no, dollars. Ah, I hear the big daddy. Right. Uh... Right, here we go. I've only got the drill. I've drilled a couple of these guys Adam before. Is Rapture Delta, the finest mines of paradise in a single sublime mosaic, Eleanor. Consider the genius you deny her with every stolen drop. It's a bit of a basic like understanding, <laughs> I admit. But but is she trying to say she basically wants to shove a bunch of Adam into her daughter? Kind of like Fontaine did at the end of the first game, and he just went Hulk mode. 
Is she, is she kind of wanting that for Eleanor? Or is she wanting that in a more structured way where she doesn't turn into an actual monster? Oh shit. Oh hell yes. Right, the days of being a noob are over. I'm gonna camera every single person. Hello. <gasps> Electrical storm. Is this gonna give me the self-defense? I bet it is. Yes. You emit a burst of electricity when struck, shocking all around you. I wonder if you have that and the fire one, which is f it is it's the same but with fire. I wonder if it has a chance of doing both. Uh, I need to equip that. Uh, but I don't know what to get rid of. Everything is really useful right uh, so far. Um, I'll store in gene bank and then I'll do a proper checkup. Oh! Don't, don't scare- Where the fuck did he just come from? <laughs> that jump scare failed, sir. Oh, hello. Use. How's that functional? Pin money women's apparel ad. 1959 sale. Right, well, let's continue. Atlantic Express ad. Atlantic Express. Faster metro travel, is that what it says? Women's club. Every Thursday at four. Every Thursday, that's women's hour. Is that like a, a, a club slash pub women's hour sort of a thing? This is a gentleman's bathroom. What's a lady doing in here? Oh my god. That's, uh... Something... She she got a condition. <laughs> Damn. That's what plasmids do to you. No teeth left. That's rough. No tapes recorded on the toilets. Don't mind me hitting the flammable looking pipe. Incinerate plasmid. Fire at your fingertips. What's with the ads in the bathrooms? It's kind of weird. Salty's potato chips ad. <laughs> I could go for some of those right now. Dames! Oh my god, this is some outdated shit. Rapture Masquerade Ball, 1959. I thought these masks had a very um, masquerade ball feel to the masks. It's because they actually had masquerade parties and shit. Cool. Right, anyway. Right, here we go, Gene Bank. Okay. What can I replace for the fire? Um, not the fire. That's that's the fire one. No, I want the electric one. I'm, I need drill specialist for now. I'm enjoying it. Um, honestly, it's so good with the half reduction of plasmid Eve usage. I can't see myself going back now to to unequipping this because then the Eve usage will feel ridiculously large. Um, you take less from fire damage and inflict more fire damage. So I didn't even realize um, I do more fire damage. So my self explode thing is doing more damage. Medical expert that might I might have to get rid of that. Um, I did look at this one drill lurker before before I recorded um, this episode. I had a brief look at them and it, I'm not you re really using this. Quiets your footsteps and increases damage from melee attacks on unaware opponents, especially with the drill swing. Now, I thought I'm not really sneaking up on people, but at the same time, I've got quite a footstep, so I, I, I can probably still run up and just hit one before he even knows I'm there with this tonic on. Self-defense, can't get rid of that. More Adam from the girls, can't get rid of that. 
you take no damage from electricity, and you deal more damage when you do electrical attacks, including the self-destruct, so... I've got a hell of a, like, a self-defense, um, setup here. With a, a drill and self-defense setup. So can't get rid of that. First aid kits also give you Eve. I can't get rid of that, because that's really useful. Plasma juice, let's see, I can't get rid of any of these. Drill damage, drill freezes. I'm gonna have to tr get rid of the drill lurker one. I'm just going ham anyway, so fuck it. This is not a stealthy game, uh, a playthrough of the game. Uh, done. Right, I kind of want to let someone hit me now. I want to see somebody get burned and fizzled at the same time. <laughs> that would be epic. Right, okay. Restrooms complete. I can hear the big daddy in the next room. Somebody had a go at me in one of the in <laughs> the comments of one of the videos saying I just eat and drink everything like an idiot even when I'm full health on that. Uh, and it is true, I do. Um, so I apologize for frustrating you. The thing is, once you've got the tonic that lets you get both health and eve from drinking alcohol, I forgot which things give you health and which things give you al um, eve. So I just started to eat and drink everything. There she is. Little Tyke wants to be in pictures. <laughs> Real cute. Now get rid of the muscle and deal with her. This guy's evil as shit. He's spending all of... He's spending all the lamb's money on hookers and dancers and shit. I'm gonna let Big Daddy deal with all the, uh... I'll tell you what, no, no, let's, let's get the Big Daddy dead and let's get the little sister. Um... Oh, are they fighting each other? This is just, I'm just enjoying the show here. Weird. No, right, he's dead. If he comes close, I'm gonna stun that dude. He didn't actually kill him, did he? This is a cool room. I like Stanley. <laughs> I like what Stanley said, this little sister is just trying to be a film star or something, because I, I guess she's supposed to be on the stage or something. Right, okay. Oh, she's actually doing the body shit on the floor. That's cool. Right, well, okay, here we go. I'm full, basically. Jesus, they're loud. Are, are these guys red? when they're elite bouncers. Because these are more red than I remember. Drill the motherfucker! Ow. <laughs> Dude. One more. Gotcha. Nice. Oh, yeah. Honest. Hang on, come here. Come here. Between my uh, freezing with the drilling, freezing and stunning with Electro Bolt, they barely can get a, an attack off the ground. Let me know how good I'm doing in this playthrough. With with my choices of like weaponry and battle te battle technique. <laughs> my tactics and shit. I feel like I've I happen to have come across a really powerful combo that most people probably wouldn't try first playthrough. I another aka I like to think I'm smart. <sighs> right, hang on. Alright, this is a dead end. Let's check this area out. Oh, I wanted to hear what she said then. Three children. We're in the back of the movie theater right now. What is this place called? Triton Theater. Okay. A secular saint. 
The genius of Sophia Lamb is a thing of empathy, a profound moral sense. I can only describe her as a kind of secular saint. But dividing her loyalty evenly across the world at large spreads it so thin as to be invisible to some. Love, I have found, is beneath her. Naturally, Ryan arrested her, gave her to Sinclair to incarcerate somewhere. But upon her escape, she took the city and changed my life forever. Oh, she escaped. Have I, did I gloss over that at some other point? She was captured by Ryan, given to Sinclair, the head of security, I think. Uh, but she escaped. Huh. I guess she has enough follows and so on to break her out. I didn't realize she escaped. Cool. Interesting. But yeah, love isn't beneath her. Love is above her. She's too heartless and stupid to, to feel the power of love and all that. Mm-hmm. All right, what else is in here? Oh. Save point. Okay. Right. Here's body number one. Angel. This is going to be hairy because it's very open, is this? But let's do it. Okay. Ooh. Oh, right, yeah. Oh, shit, hang on. Um, I'm empty on drill fuel. Um, that would make this unnecessarily hard. Oh, the nearest thing is miles away. I tell you what, let's... I've got so much Eve. Let's just try stunning them and swatting them rather than charging, just, just to see how much damage I take from this. The, the little sister might even die here. I can stun for days, so I'll keep stunning. I can afford one. I can afford two. Fuck me, I'm taking damage. I can afford three. <laughs> At least I had some drill fuel, eh? Right, that's it, I'm out. Is she done, yeah? Ow. I'm starting to take some serious fucking damage from their melee attacks. Have you noticed? I swear to God, I'm, I'm taking more melee damage now than I was before. Like, significantly more. I had to use four... Yeah, four first aid kits there. Okay, so... When I'm out of drill fuel, I'm definitely struggling. There he is, there you go. I guess I just I'm just oh shit. Shit. I didn't press the I swear to god even my melee attacks are doing less damage. I wonder if the way the enemies work in this game is just as you progress like, you rescue more little sisters and you harvest more bodies. Basically, you're progressing. I wonder if shit, like, levels up and gets stronger. I really noticeably struggled with that fight, then. More than previous. Uh, and I know I didn't have any charging, so I had to rely on just swinging. But even so, I struggled, huh? Shit. Right, okay. I do believe we've got everything. I also believe I can go upstairs here. Yeah? 
Maybe I should be mindful of where the, um... What am I trying to say? Be mindful of where the vending machines are, and even in the middle of a fight, and the healing stations. And go out of my way to heal and buy ammo. Oh shit. Right, can we check out that balcony? The upper tier for the posh people. I need him to come at me. <laughs> oh! I thought my freezing thing only worked when drilling, not the swipe, but hey, it works. Both. Alright. It does have Adam, but I need health kits before we do the next one. Is that the as journalist? A religion, they merely monitored us, but as a commune, they would see us crucified. And yet, though he will be the last to see it, Andrew Ryan has already lost the people. Wherever I am sent, rapture will follow. I hope I get to kill Sophia Lamb at the end of this game. I sincerely do. Right, I need a vending machine. Um, is there one upstairs on the right? Oh, sorry, through here, the projection booth. Huh. I'm too lazy to... <laughs> To hack myself. <sighs> yeah, I should. I should definitely make a point of of looting before I go to a vending machine because I bet I get to full health kits just by looting now. You watch. Hey, look! It's a typewriter. Let's save our progress. Giggle, giggle. Um, nothing else in here. Where's the projection booth? Oh, right, there it is. This wasn't on the uh, ma map, was it? No, it wasn't. Oh. What the fuck's that clown symbol? Adam! Oh, that's the body on the balcony. Okay. Okay. Ooh hoo hoo. Gimme. Gimme. Gimme a man after midnight. Can I put something on the projector? <laughs> Extended reel. Um research sessions last a bit longer. I prefer my melee combat. Without ones like take reduced damage from melee attacks, I'd be screwed. Right, there's no hidden tapes or anything. I wish I could appear on the big screen down there. Oh shit! Fuck me! Have you noticed there are some sound effects that are louder in this game? Like, refilling your plasmid, or when you take a hit, and your big daddy goes, Ugh! It's so- it's super loud compared to everything else. Um... Huh. Oh well, fuck it. It is what it is. I guess your guy is supposed to be loud. Oh, I can't buy any first aid. Okay. Right, let's go do that thing. With... Oh no, I need to actually buy some first aid. I'm not going to survive with two things of health. Um, first aid... St I, uh, first aid station won't even help. Uh, 
Yes, it will. Hacking gives me a free kit, and then destroying gives me another kit. I'm gonna heal to full. That's another first aid. Um. Oh, bullshit. Where's my dude charging to? Okay, when Okay, my guy struggles with charging the teleporty ones. Got it. Um, I could get to four health kits by destroying this, but I'd rather leave that there. I bet this has some first aid. No. No, it doesn't. Huh. Did I, like, buy out the maximum or something? You know what? Fuck it. Let's let's quick save it. We'll get to four, and that should be good enough. Nope, wrong way. You didn't hear shit. You didn't hear a damn thing. You know what I'm going to do? I'm not going to bother whipping out the camera for these events because there's like 20,000 enemies. Shit. Uh, damn it. I'm pressing the wrong shirt. But yeah, there's too many enemies. I'd have to scan each one with the camera, which is just a pain. Quick save. Oh, fuck. Right, let's just do this. God help me. At least they should be close range this time. Let's fix your face, baby. Whoa, that did no damage. Okay, my charge did no damage to the other spider. Shit! <laughs> it takes some getting used to. Done. Are we gonna be together again, Dad? We are. Yeah, Jesus. I'll tell you one problem is having, like, debris in the way. Like, like physical shit to block my charge. Because if there's a guy like... Whoa, shit. No, okay, not knowing which ones are a one-shot kill is a problem, because I'll swing, and then I'll, like, turn to run it, like, go to the next target, but they're still alive because they're a tougher enemy. That's a problem. And let's say I'm stood here, and there's a guy down there. I'll stun him perfectly well, but I can't charge through all this shit. Um... So I've got to, like, sidestep, which takes, like, five seconds, and then I can charge. But by that time, I've got to re-stun a second time. You know? So there are- it, it's not infallible. There are problems. It's not a perfect form of warfare. That's two out of three done. I've been going an hour and four minutes. Ooh. That's me there. I confronted Stanley. Said I'd tell Mother what he had done. He panicked. Took me away and sold me to an orphanage. I tried to fight back. I remember biting his hand, but... Father, he's the reason I was turned into a little sister. Motherfucker gotta die. What the fuck? So he was the- I, I was what? You know, until now. I really- when I get confused over the story, I really should just roll with it and keep playing because uh, so many of my questions get answered like an hour later. I was so fucking confused. Was it two episodes ago or whatever? When I when I went into the orphanage and there was evidence of Eleanor living in the orphanage. But previously in the game, there was evidence of her 
living in her own little contained home with Sophia Lamb. Do you know what I mean? So she she had her own little solitary sanctuary away from all other children and whatever. Like she was um, being raised specifically away from other people. Because when she met that, um, I've forgotten his name, who talked her into like wanting to leave. I can't remember his name. Amir, was it? Something like that? Um, it was sort of implied that she had very little contact with other people. Um, at least that's what my brain remembers. Um, so yeah, I saw that she had her own little house, and then we found her own like place in the orphanage. And I was so confused, I was like, eh? This makes no sense. Like, what's she doing in an orphanage? She's Sophia Lamb's protect- Highly, highly protected daughter. Uh, but now it makes sense. So when Lamb was arrested- Now, you were just a deep sea explorer with iron cojones, pal. The public gave it a nickname. But Ryan was sure you were a spook. So his people locked you up. Erased your damn name. Goodbye, Johnny Topside. Hello, Subject Delta. I'll give Stanley Pool this. He's an absolute piece of shit. Like a piece of shit. He took... He kidnapped someone else's daughter and sold that child to an orphanage. Oh my god. When all this is over and we're divvying up Rapture's bounty, you and I'll be holding court on a private island, son. Think of it. Each world power on bended knee, holding a bouquet made of money. Why is everyone so fucking money hungry? The girls you've saved from mother want to thank you. Check the gatherer's garden. Nice one. I want to see what this is. Is it always just like like extra Adam and then like, like some ammo or something? Jesus, I keep getting interrupted here. Um. So yeah. So Stanley Pool, I'll give him this much. He is at least honest. I've learned more in the last two minutes than I have in the entire game so far. So we were a topside guy. We we used our own diving thing to come down and just check shit out. Entered the city. Andrew Ryan thought we were a spy. I mean, that's typical Andrew Ryan. Um, and then he had us, like, arrested and turned into a big daddy. That is, you know, I keep, I keep sort of comparing who's more evil, Fontaine, Lamb, or Ryan. And it's just, just on repeat, they are all, like... You keep getting reminded how evil all three of them are. So Andrew Ryan literally kidnapped a dude and turned him into a big daddy, and that's us. We're some innocent bystander sort of guy. Uh, hang on, there's a room over there. Any more upstairs? Nope. All done? Yep. Let's go to that room over there. Uh... Does that connect through there? It does, doesn't it? Okay. Yeah. So we were kidnapped, turned into a big daddy. We were then partnered with... Just coincidentally partnered with... Eleanor Lamb. Who had been kidnapped by Stanley Poole and sold to an orphanage. And that's... And that was... That orphanage isn't an orphanage at all. It's a little system-making factory. So Stanley Poole basically sold her to the Little Sister program. And and yet, yeah, that's funny. I'm sorry, I've got to pause to get my thoughts out or I can't fucking think. It's funny because at the start of this game, Lamb is talking to us and treating us like we are to blame for everything. We, we were just a big daddy assigned to her, do you know what I mean? And yet she's talking, she, she treated us like we're the piece of shit. No. She, I don't think she knows it, but Stanley pulls the piece of shit. He's the sole reason. Any more? Yeah, Stanley Poole is literally the sole reason Eleanor became a little sister. That's crazy. I wonder if Andrew Ryan knew that it was Sophia Lamb's daughter. Because then he would be like, yes, please, let, let us let us screw over Lamb by turning her daughter into a... a what you call it? A little sister. 
I'd love to use the jukebox, but I, this game keeps slapping me on the YouTube for copyright, so I can't. Right. Any more thingy my bobs? Um, were there any tapes in here? Maybe in the staff room? Uh, okay. Dude, it's, it's a bit quiet, but the ambience is scaring me right now. Um, what else have we got here? Oh, that just drained my Eve. Wonderful. Learning poker. You must learn to play poker, Eleanor. Oh, cool. Like anyone, I am flawed and have a fierce genetic bias towards competition. But each Saturday, I read the other players, and I pick a man who will benefit the most from victory. By the final hand, I ensure that he takes home my entire stake and that of the others. You suck at poker, I then. Nothing but the feeling of conquest over myself, and the wealth of my competitors is slowly reshuffled according to their need. She's trying to come across like she's mindful and she's losing on purpose, and she's she's learning about the psychology and shit. No, what you're really just doing is losing all your money because you suck. WHY DO I SUCK?! Is there any bot shutdown panels? Bot shutdown panels! Bot shutdown! I need some bot shutdown! Any bot shutdown? Bot shutdown! <laughs> Fuck you! Good googly moogly. I don't know what's going on today. I've lost all my ability to time a button press. Right, come on. Let's at least not land in the red, because that's that's what causes the alarm. Come on. Yes! Yes! I don't even need any of that. But what I'm really looking for is dollars and, like, first aid. Oh, there. But that is funny, though. She, she's playing poker intentionally to lose under some misguided idea that she's like learning more about psychology. I don't know, it's almost like something a monk would do if he still had some possessions to get rid of, you know what I mean? Intentionally lose it to other people on purpose. So you're like giving people all your possessions or something without them really knowing. But, but it's not, Sophia Lam is just an idiot who thinks she's the master of the mind or some bullshit. Right. This area is done. I, I, I wanted to get all three little sisters in this one episode. But I'm going slow as shit because I am slow as shit. I've got an entire other area to do here. Let's beeline to the little sister number three. Um, I, I will beeline, but at the same time, I want to make sure I'm not missing any, uh, tapes. Uh, I think both ways connect round. I'm going to go with that other way, because I don't recognise that shit. Oh, right, I see. Hang on, is this where we... Yeah, this is where Stanley Poole is. Let's take another look at Stanley Poole, since he's right here. There's still another girl out there. Look at this creepy motherfucker. That might, that, that might have to be the thumbnail of this video. Stanley Poole and all his bullshit. So you sold a little girl 
to a little si to to the little sister manufacturing plant, disguised as a uh, as a G darn orphanage, which it isn't at all. See, this is where it came from. It it looks like it is connected with all the rest, but at the same time, uh. You know, I'm sorry, I'm going back the other way. I don't, I don't trust that it connects around. W once again, I'm, I'm being reaffirmed that everybody in Rapture is evil and just full of shit. I hope we don't, like, let him leave. I, I want Stanley Poole to die a horrible death. This is one time, I hope. Baby. Whew. This is one time I hope Dr. Lamb suddenly does one of her, like, things where she comes on the radio, locks him in the room and, like, kills him. Because he deserves it. It's like the only time in the game I will be on Dr. Lamb's side if she kills him. So he spent all her money, sold her daughter into... Essentially, she might as well be dead. He, he essentially killed her daughter. Right, let's go. Here we go. Oh, you know what? Oh, I recognize this. This is, uh... Ah, this was locked before. I see. Um... Right, the little sister's there. Hang on! Have I got this completely wrong? I'm doing the maths here. I think we came from the, that direction. Either way, we need to go through there. And that's the place where it said it was flooded, or it was revealed that this place could easily be flooded. Um, let's just run straight through before that music plays. Oh! Thank you. Demanding father. I need- right, okay, the, the next thing I need to do, period, is buy some extra tonic slots. Because I'm, I'm desperately low here. Little sisters- ah, little sisters gather at him more quickly. That is a blessing right there. Because these- these events are like a pain in the ass. Right, let's store it, and- fuck's sake. Die. Right. Here we go. It's the most important thing, even more than awesome plasmids. Um, I need at least three that I've taken off that I want to put back on. So one. Um, hang on. Two. They are getting more expensive. Um, I've got so much. But I'll tell you what. Uh... This is one of those things I'm not that inter- it's working so well stunning, I said this before, I'm not that interested in all, uh, the rest of them. I know how good some of them are. I know. But, you know, like, Cyclone Trap is really useful for, like, stunning them, I guess, but... Especially Winter Blast, because then one single hit kills them. I wonder if that's better. I think we've had this discussion before, but that might be better than, than Electro stunning them. Because they're stunned for way longer. Um, let's just buy another slot anyway. That's three. Let's, uh... Let us actually apply that shit. And see if I'm desperate for any more slots. Right, Demanding Father, that's, an, that's a must. Makes life easier. Um... I suppose I don't really need that many others. Um, but I've I had cure all on before. More easy when I use a health station, but I I barely heal from those things anyway. Um, I had the drill lurker on, but not really bothered with that one. Where's the where's the alcohol one that gives me? health when I drink alcohol or some shit. Uh, da, 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 da. 
It's just a scroll thing. Or have I equipped it again? Um, da -da -da -da. Where is it? Eh? I know damn well I had a tonic that when you drank alcohol it doesn't remove Eve, it gives you Eve instead. But I cannot find it. Hack, alarms, research, turrets, hat hack, drill lurker, cure all isn't that. Standing water slowly heals you, that might be nice, but I don't really care again. Oh, it is. No, no, it's not. Ah! Oh, yeah! Oh! Scroll wheel doesn't go up and down. D w and S does. They were hidden at the top. There it is. There's two. Fast and moving and booze hound. I'll have the booze hound because it means I can just go drink everything and get back to full. And I'm tempted to equip sports boost. Somebody did say in a comment that it doesn't really seem to make you faster, but any any boost at all it really helps. And for now, I think I'm good with those slots. Um, so I won't buy any more just yet. Um, but I might as well buy the upgrade to, like, Winter Blast. Um, and you know what? Because of that, Let's buy another plasma slot. And I'll equip... Oh, shit. Right, okay. Hypnotize, not bothered. Incinerate, I'm only using it to melt shit, not bothered. Cyclone Trap is n nice. But I'd have to buy three ranks of it. Huh. Okay, what else? Decoy, security command... Oh, shit. Oh, fucking hell. I tell you, the scrolling in this game. You could easily play this entire game and not notice you can scroll down, because you've got to... It's This game is made for control. Security command. Um, call in a friend with the added ability to summon bots. Nope. Hacker. I'm good enough at hacking. Machine buster damage. Mm, short circuit. Mm. You gain a little extra health. That's kind of nice. Easy hack. Don't care. I don't really care about any of the hacking stuff. Your headshots do more damage. I don't think drill applies headshots. Security doesn't matter. Vending machine prices, whatever. Oh my god, you emit a burst of ice when struck by melee attacks. I've already got fire and electricity. That's a f that's a must. Um, cool. Hang on, research bonus. Don't care. Quick hack. Don't care. I'm saying I don't care to a lot of these, but I've, you know, I've got plenty of slots free. Um, you know what? Let's do the one where it's either larger zones or it's slower. Wh which is better? It moves slightly slower. Honestly, the speed is fine. Let's go with the one that gives me a bigger... A bigger zone. That one. And then... Supply. Let's buy two more slots. Oops, hang on. One. Oh! I've got to get further in the game for the next slot. Right, which one's best? That ice one has to, has to be best. Dude, nice. Nice. I'm hoping, let me know in the comments, I'm hoping the ice defense... Electric defense and the fire defense don't share a percentage chance of happening. If you see what I'm saying. Like, if you've got a 10% chance of having the defensive shit happen. I want, like, 10% for each of the elements. Do you see what I mean? So, I don't have 10% total chance. I want, like, 30% chance of one of those three things happening. But, but let me know if I'm wrong. Let me know if it's, like, simply a 10% chance of happening. Um, and then when it happens, if it's any of the three random elements, you know? Quick save. Let's do this. This is gonna be a long episode. Um... Alright, there's one. Clobber the big Toluca and grab the sister!
Will do. This is going to be an extra, extra long episode because I want to f finish all three in this episode. Faster, Mr. B. It's time to go. It's time to go! Why did he take so much damage? Freeze! <laughs> yes. Dude. Right, let's just get on it. Um, this is a good enough body. Let's do this one. Quick save. Right, so here we go. Let's try and be as fast as possible about all this. Um, now I've got the tonic that makes this faster. So let's see how fast it is. You know, I swear the first couple of times I did this, it took longer than it does these, uh, than it has done recently. Even before this tonic. Fuck. I can't kill that guy. Um. I hope she's okay over there. I've got no long range. She's done, yeah. Let's get her, let's get her real quick. I am, I am, let's go. You ain't no holoback, girl. You ain't no holoback. Was he about to say you ain't her real dad? Well, fuck you. Uh, let's see how big the zones are now. Uh, hmm, interesting. I don't th you know, that's funny. I don't think, like, the width on the dial is any wider. I think it's just literally more zoomed in, so you can see easier. I think. Um, I might try, um... You know, I forgot to equip Winter Blast, I'm an idiot. Let's go back to the thing. I don't want this episode to get too long. Um, I'll, so I'll do that real fast, and then I'll go get the last body we need. Um, plasmid slot, boom. Let's equip. Uh, no, 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 wrong one, wrong one. Let us equip Winter Blast. And I'm going to try that exclusively instead of Electro. I bet it works better, you know, because I know that it stuns them for far longer when they're frozen. You just lose the loot. But... In fact, didn't I comment on this much earlier in the playthrough? Um, how that won't bother me as long as I've got, like, lots of loot and money and stuff. I don't need much loot, because I'm only using the drill. I'm not I don't need any ammo of any gun, so the loot isn't that... Um... The loot isn't as big a problem anymore. I need drill fuel and, like, health kits. And that's it, really. Right, last one. That- that was way faster, by the way. So that tonic is doing great. Oh! <laughs> Oh, shit. Oh, right, yeah. Okay, perfect opportunity to test the freezing. I might, um, I might not charge this one. I want to see how long they stay stunned. Hang on. Hang on, hang on. They do unfreeze, but... Right, I wanted to test it now, like... Like five seconds. Right, it's like five seconds. And it's, it's always... Unless it's like a big daddy, just regular enemies, it's always a one-shot kill. Which is better than the electricity. They're getting tougher now, so it's taken more than one hit to kill, even when they're stunned. 
Mm. He's nicer than other daddies. I'm I'm starting to think the winter blast might might well be better. Honestly. Might well be better. For my drill close range combat. In fact, it is. What am I talking about? It stuns them for, like... The electricity stuns them, like... Dzzz, done. It's, like, two full seconds. The the freeze is, like, five full seconds. So it's twice as long as stun. And on regular enemies, it always kills them in one. So, yeah, all next episode, I think I'm going to just, just try Winter Blast. Um. The one thing it can't do is, fr is stun a bunch of enemies in one. Because, um, oh shit. With me gone, father, Stanley just let mother's followers turn into animals. When word came that she was returning, he knew they would blame him. So he found a way to silence them all. And now he's trying to cover it up. Achievement unlocked nose for news. That's it. Now all that old dirt stays underground, and Lamb will be none the wiser. Hey, come on back. I've unlocked the train for you. Uh, but remember, if Lamb catches you, <laughs> mum's the word. If Lamb catches me, I'm gonna let her look into my memories if if she can do that. Right. Okay. I Our conflict of interest seems to be upsetting Eleanor. For her sake, I have made it clear to these men that you are not to suffer. I accept full responsibility for any anger you may experience before you die. Okay. I've just... I... Mid, uh... Oh, fuck me, what's going on here? Doc Lamb's turning up the heat, Chief. Head on back to the train station. Let's hit the trail. I've just noticed, actually, my freeze isn't always a one-shot kill. That's just my charge being super powerful. When I froze the, uh, the spider splicer then, it didn't die with one hit. Which is interesting. Whoa! Okay. Last thing we do this episode. Big sister. I'll try freezing her. See? Hey. Let's get in here. Maybe when, a, when an enemy is frozen, there's only a chance they'll shatter when you hit them. Oh my god, she's tough as fuck. She's tougher than I remember. She's so much stronger than I remember. Drill the motherfucker. Right, Jesus. Right, hang on, I need to kill these other motherfuckers. I've got plenty of Eve. I can keep freezing. I need them to come at me. Oh, oh, she's healing. Dude, that's ridiculous. Oh, I didn't take... <laughs> okay, let's not address that. Um, oh, fuck off, man. I tell you, that fight would have been a lot easier without 17 fucking splices. Jesus. The freezing worked so well with my reduced Eve usage. I could literally keep um, freezing her on cooldown, repeatedly. That's almost too strong. If I was the developer of this game, um, we're gonna end the episode here. If I was the developer of this game, I would make it so this um, plasmid system had diminishing returns, so the more you stun them, the less effective it is, until basically, like, three freezes into fighting a big sister, you can't freeze them anymore. Like, I would implement proper diminishing returns. Because that's ridiculous. 
it uses like no Eve to stun them anymore. So I can just go stun, stun, stun. <laughs> Gave me all the time in the world to kill the pesky splices. Right, anyway, thanks for joining me for this episode. <sighs> Jesus, this was an action-packed one. We rescued all three little sisters. We learned what a piece, what a P.O.S. What a piece of steaming shit Stanley Pool is. And he thinks he's safe. I've got a feeling that the whole reason he wants us to get rid of these little sisters is because you can see the, the memories in the Adam and shit. But I've got a feeling Dr. Lamb is going to see those memories somehow later in the game anyway. Or maybe she already knows. The one story thing that's uh, confusing me at this point is Stanley mentioned, um, come on, brain work. I think I've forgotten my train of thought. Um, oh, it said, Eleanor said that Stanley covered up, um, his shit so that no one would know how. Like, like everyone knew. And then Eleanor specifically said he then covered it up so that no one would know. How did he stop all these millions of people in Splices knowing? I think I missed a, a Mr. Beat there. Anyway, like this video if you liked it. Like this video if you didn't like it. And subscribe for more. All my links are in my description of this video. And I have a Patreon if you want to go above and beyond to support my content. I'll catch you guys in the next episode where we go back to Stanley Poole and I kind of want to drill him in the face. Not going to lie. Um, I wonder if it's going to give us... I should just end the video. Um, but I'm wondering if it's going to give us the opportunity to kill him if we want to. You know what I'm saying? Like it has done before. Um, and this time round, I may well end up killing him. If that's the case. Anyway, catch you next time. Liquid Blitz.